Yeah, excited about who we have uh, coming into uh, to our program. We got 14 guys that are already hitting the ground running, started here with, in the second semester with us. Uh, excited to get the other guys here when we get into uh, to late May, early June. Um, these guys are all going to have to make an impact for us and, and grow inside of our program quickly. Uh, excited about the people that we brought in, just who they are and what they're about, and uh, obviously their skill sets as well. You, got, you guys were looking at cut-ups, the film. Were you looking for what worked, what didn't work? What specifically are you guys looking at? Yeah, I, I think, you know, the, the off-season is a, a great opportunity. A year ago, you're just installing as fast as you can uh, with your players having a chance to digest what's going on, but your staff, too. Now you know your personnel. I think you have to also anticipate, um, you know, where you're going to be. Um, you need some development inside your program as guys leave. Excited about the three guys that are in the senior bowl and the performance that they had. Um, but you got to anticipate where you are. Understand that guys got to grow too. Uh, you look at what worked, what didn't work, why didn't it work. Um, you know, you're looking at it from a, sch a scheme standpoint to a teaching standpoint to does it fit our personnel. Now that's. Looking at your personnel last year, you got to anticipate where you are now this coming year as well. So uh, there's a, a myriad of, of factors that uh, that you know you're you're trying to anticipate your best movement forward as a program. You mentioned the ten assistants that are remaining with you. How important do you think that is from year one to year two to maintain that continuity? Yeah, I, I think that continuity allows you to springboard uh, forward. Um, there's a clear understanding of who we are, how we're going to operate, how we're going to function inside of the building, uh, the roles that we have, how, you know, as you go back to self-scout your players, now you get a chance to go back and, and analyze your staff too, and how do we become more efficient in what we're doing um, to, to make us the best program that we can be. Um, that consistency inside of your, your program, I, I think, is, is important. Uh, at the same time, you know, we'll have staff that eventually will leave here um, because of great opportunities. But, um, you know, a big part of me being here is, is the power of the T. And, and, you know, that's from resources to retain good staff uh, where they don't take lateral moves to, you know, the city that you're living in and, and the passion and, and expectations of, of this program. You, t you said uh, last year we're making up yards, now you're making up inches. What are yeah. inches? Yeah, yeah um, <laughs> I, I think it's just a visual for our players, you know. Um, know who we are and, and how we function when I first got in the building you know to, to who we are today you know there's a, a huge difference in that you know the investment in what we're doing um, what we do you know I'm just talking to our off season from strength and conditioning to <coughs> excuse me uh, to, to spring ball to off season it's not a lot different they know who we are and what we're, our expectations are they know what's coming now it's being dialed into the to the details of, of what you're doing and being you know completely invested in it emotionally and physically and, and uh, mentally and, and uh, you know that's the strain that we got to to have this entire off season to to make up uh, the ground that we need to make up as a program. You fielded a, a joke, a question in there about faking cramps, opponents faking <laughs> cramps. Yeah. How different is the game if that's weeded out? Of games, how how much does that affect things if, if that's fixed? If um, it has a it has certainly has an impact on, on the game and and uh, and how we play and uh, and what we do. At the end of the day, we can only control what we can control. Let's line up and, and play ball. We're not ready yet, but we will be next <laughs> September. Coach, 